right, so I got my second package from Jet.com. And this one has some refrigerated items. So let's take a look. A lot of padding in here. A lot of bubble wrap. Okay, we have compartments. A big couple thing. And oh, these must be you know, bananas. Use this kind of web padded cardboard. Yeah, it's a little refrigerated. I mean, they're all, these seem to be okay. They're a little bit too ripe. We have our spaghetti squash. They seem to come in okay. Wait, you didn't... More bananas? Now, in my order, I ordered five bananas. This looks like seven plus, plus the ones I had. I might have doubled my order. Let's see. And here we have even more bananas. I guess they're just giving me whatever they had at the time. How many bananas? Oh my god, it's way too many bananas. Yeah, these are not the bananas at the bottom. They look like they sprung some kind of leak. You can see from the cardboard. Um, yeah, I guess I'm making shakes all weekend. Um, but Let's see what is in the middle. Alright, so I ripped it open and there's a layer of insulation in between these things and then there's the actual package itself. And here, what do we have? Apples. Cold pack. Some Pillsbury Grands. Limes, Jello. All these seem to be in good condition. More cold packs. Ballpark bun size. Franks. Fully cooked bacon. Even more gel packs. Purdue ground turkey. Another gel pack, a melon, more gel packs, tofu, and another gel pack. Uh, so, mass wise, I think it's half packaging and half the actual products that they're shipping. Um, I think I'm going to fill up my garbage can with just this filler. Um, overall, everything came in good. Nothing really damaged. Um, so, I got a good deal off of it. I might order again.